Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, The Wealthy Mindset. It's yours truly, Money Making Mitch. And as usual, guys, this is not financial advice. Please do your own due diligence and research. So I asked in my last video if my subscribers would like me to do a video of a company to add to your portfolio. And Money Making Carl Lambert, aka Carl Heinz Rumanega in England, said he would like to hear about it. So here it is. You see, I spoke about Pony AI when it was about $8. And I'm not buying it now, it ran too much. So the reason why I got into Pony AI is because of William Lee. He, uh, he invested heavily into that company. But what is another play that we can get into that I believe will also be one of the uh, players, one of the leaders in the robo taxi field uh, that has a huge um, audience and presence in China, Australia, Europe, and Latin America. I'm talking about none other than DD Global. So, DD Autonomous Driving and GAC Ion are jointly developing a next generation factory installed autonomous vehicle scheduled for delivery by late 2025, yes, this year, with pilot programs to follow in Beijing, Guangzhou, and other cities. Um, but apart from that, there's other stuff going on uh, why I think this would be a good, comp a good, another good one. You know, high risk, just like Neo when it first started, but with high rewards. Uh, a growth company, DD Autonomous Driving secures 281 million funding L4 model with GAC Ion to deliver by year end. On October 11, 2025, DD Autonomous Driving here and after, referred to as DD announced the completion of its Series D financing round, raising a total of $281 million. Investors include Zhongchuan Science City Technology Growth Fund, several Beijing-based industrial funds, GAC Group, Guangzhou, Guanghua Fund, and DD Group itself. Financing rounds for DD Autonomous Driving, DD stated that the new funding will be used to intensify AI research, artificial intelligence research, and accelerate the deployment of L4 autonomous driving in more cities. So I was saying in the past that I was telling actually some of my subscribers that I talked to on the phone, like Money Making George in England, that Uber um, did a robotaxi deal, Lyft did a robotaxi deal, partnership I should say, to get into robotaxis, but Didi is doing it with GAC. They're pretty much doing it by themselves, but GAC is going to build the cars for them. Um, excuse me. The only mistake I think they're making is I'm I'm hoping it's not. They, I'm hoping they do battery swapping with this robo taxi, but we'll see. Public records show that this is the seventh financing round since DD's founding, with total funding exceeding 1.83 billion dollars in just research and development. Previous investors include SoftBank, Valio, GAC Group, and IDG. In terms of timeline, DD was among the earliest players in China to focus on L4 autonomous driving. The autonomous driving team was established in 2016 under co-founder Zhuang Bo, upgraded to an independent company in 2019, and has accumulated nearly a decade of expertise in AI mass production and operations. In 2020, following the launch of RoboTaxi services in Shanghai, DD secured over $500 million in Series A financing led by SoftBank Vision Fund. Over the following years, DD partnered with automakers in 2023, GAC Group through GAC Capital and Guangzhou Development Zone Investment Group. Now, why am I telling you guys this? Well, just like with DD, just like with Uber, just like with Lyft, there's going to be just like I should say with Pony AI and We Ride and Apollo Go, et cetera, et cetera, there's going to be more than one robo taxi company. And I love the price that DD is at right now. Establish, they establish a special fund investing up to 149 million in DD autonomous driving that year. 
Didi also launched an Orca computing platform and Bayao Beta LiDAR achieving 24-hour autonomous vehicle operations in Shanghai. Didi's autonomous driving vehicle for commercial deployment, Didi and GSE Ion established Guangzhou Andi technology in 2024 to accelerate L4 autonomous vehicle mass production. In July 2025, the first production model debuted at GAC Technology Day and was added to the MIIT's, this is the Chinese government, 400 batch vehicle catalog on October 9th. The L4 autonomous driving vehicle co-developed by DD and GAC Ion, the vehicle is scheduled for delivery by the end of 2025 and will be showcased in demonstration projects in Beijing, Guangzhou and other cities. To date, DD Autonomous Driving has deployed over 3,000 L4 test vehicles across 11 cities including Beijing, Shanghai and Guangzhou with a cumulative test mileage exceeding 80 million kilometers placing it among the leading domestic robo-taxi operators. So, in my opinion, this is a good play, a good addition to our portfolio. It is still in the early stages, but as you can see, they are accelerating at a massive rate, probably because of all the investment they did in AI. So I hope you guys found this video yet again on a Sunday to be informational, inspirational, and motivational. If so, guys, boom, boom, boom. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up right there and that, that hype button. It takes a lot of time to do these videos and the editing. And if you haven't yet subscribed, you might want to think about doing so because in this channel, we are waking up the middle class for the first time to get a major piece of the pie from the ground level up as to how the games are played on Wall Street. And like Fiddy said, we get rich or we die trying, guys.